Good. Good. And good. Hello, guys. Hey, guys. Boom. We are good. Buffalo chicken uh, and bacon burritos for me tonight. 2,000 calories, high protein, little basket of french fries. I'm starving. You guys saw what I ate last night. I, you know, copped out. I did uh, what? After the burrito, I had one egg salad sandwich. So, um, and I knew I was hungry because 2.45, 3 o'clock in the morning, I made the mistake of leaving double stuffed Oreos in the cookie corner. And I went a munching. I went to town on them. Hello, Abby. Hello, Abby. How you doing, girl? And I woke up to a munching. Not me. A munching little freaking child munching on Jamie's cookies. I woke up to Ugh. the crinkle crinkle on the crunch crunch. Hey, Monica. <laughs> Hello, Melissa. Hello, Melissa. Hey, Monica. Uh, Keki, why don't you show them, tell so them what I you have got going on. teriyaki chicken with mashed sweet potatoes and some green beans. My plate's really hot. No, Abby, uh, our daughter did. Oh, no. I woke up to our daughter munch munching in the corner. Then wakes me up and tells me she's hungry. No, Abby asked if I ate the uh, egg salad sandwiches for oh. lunch. Oh, no, our I daughter said, no, did. our daughter did. Oh, no, gobbled she, those. Listen, oh, she gobbled that sucker up. Those things With were, the tomato and everything, and yeah, she doesn't like tomato. Those thing, those egg, egg salad sandwiches were really good last night, and it was like partially me getting full, and me... If you saw how I ate the egg salad sandwich, you saw how many napkins I went through to that sandwich. So oh, thank you, Abby. I did not like the fact that they were so damn messy, messy, and I don't like eating like a pig in front of anybody. So, what's up, Diesel? Your dinner looks awesome. Thank you very much. Thank uh, you, Diesel. Are you two eating all that? Uh, yeah, uh, well, I don't really have a lot. I have two pieces of chicken and some sweet potatoes and some green beans. Yeah, I got. It's four, really not a lot. I've got four burritos. One has two bites because I let my brother try it before I got to try it and he said it's really good but it's got a kick so your butt's gonna be on fire <laughs> so uh, <laughs> yeah. but I'm willing to take it I'm gonna take the heat I already know Jamie's butt's gonna be on fire tomorrow there's a lot of buffalo sauce in that sucker are you gonna drink are you drinking kool-aid no I'm drinking Popeye's beverage of choice this I think they meant the red drink but I wasn't drinking it yet but this is not kool-aid Right hand of God, this is homemade food punch. Mm -mm. Good protein for her. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Lisa. How you doing, girl? Uh, Pedro's in the bathroom making number two. Very nice. <laughs> Very, a lot of people bring their phones in the bathroom with them when they're uh, on the toilet. It's the thing to do. What's up, John? He was a lot of hot sauce. I was like, dang, his butt's going to hurt. <laughs> well, you know what? Yeah, his butt is going to hurt. <laughs> Here's what I'll say about the hot sauce, right? If you cook it with the chicken, it does something special to, to Frank's. <clears throat> and then add some mozzarella cheese on it. It really does something good. Hello from New Jersey. Hello, Lisa. I hope you make a pizza soon. Love the videos. I might be making a pizza on Saturday. Lisa Marie said, hey guys, I love that video with your son. Aw. Yeah. Yeah, my little running buddy. He's Two days in a row. Jamie's running buddy now. <laughs> Here's the thing. I got home from work at like 5.30ish, 5.40, and I was under the assumption he was going to bail out and not want to go for the run. And the first thing he asked me was, we're still going, right? I said, yeah. He goes, when are we going? When are we going? And I just... I. You know, I just got off of work. I'm like, I wanted to relax a little bit. So I said 7.30, 7.29. He's like, come on, Daddy, get your shoes on. Let's go. And and we were <laughs> off just like that. He's doing good. He had a protein shake for uh, for breakfast, he said. He had chicken and broccoli for dinner. Yeah, he didn't really have, he didn't really ask for lunch. He had the protein shake, and he was pretty full from that. Then he went to the pool. He hung out in the pool for like, like an hour. Uh, hello, Mr. Jimmy Jam. Yeah. If it isn't the fusion, Passano and me, Hermina, hi me. Hermina. Written in this so Jamie can pronounce it the way I want, LOL. Hi me, looking to spice up the night in addition to that hot tamale besides him. Maybe, possibly. <laughs> 
Buffalo the Jimmy burrito. Jam. Buffalo, it's a buffalo chicken parmesan burrito. Watch the video. And don't you even dare tell me that's not chicken parm. It's chicken parm. Buffalo chicken chicken parm. Rah. Is he wanting to be healthier or lose weight? I didn't get into it, Abby. I j didn't ask him. I'm not, I don't want to pressure him, and I don't want him, you know, to... Uh... I could answer that question, but I'm not going to. Okay. Well, I don't know. Because he... he already got mad at me. Okay. He just springed it on <laughs> us yesterday. <laughs> Everybody's in the buffalo chicken right now. Like egg rolls. Yeah, no, we don't have egg rolls. Jaime is how you pronounce Jamie in Espanol. Yeah, I know. I knew that. I, I used to work with a Jaime. Turned out to be a rat. Rat me out almost got me fired from Cintas. <laughs> True story. I remember the Jaime. He, 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 he tattled on me for smoking in the truck. I remember. I remember the Jaime. Oh. That Jaime was a damn rat. He was he a rat. some cheese. You know what he was? He was <laughs> he was smiles and happiness to your face. And then as soon as I left the building, he did a rap 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 to human resources. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Snitches get stitches. Well, <laughs> I would have been I would have been fired back in 2009, but the lady that trained me for that job wound up dropping me off on the side of the on LIE. On the side of the LIE. So, uh, I brought <laughs> I brought that little bit piece of business up, and HR kind of just had the hands up, like, all right, don't really have nothing here. Don't smoke in the truck. I said, no problem, won't do it again. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Jess? Yeah, that girl, she was another thing. Oh, my God. Z said Jaime did? Yeah, Jaime ratted me up back in 2009. But I'll never Jaime forget. was a chihuahua, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> chihuahua. Hello, Jess. How you doing, girl? Anybody, anybody eating dinner with us? Ha, uh, I haven't seen you in a while. Where you been? Or is it us that's been missing? We're here every night. As the new school year just started, our little man has a new crush. He's looking to become a baby daddy. You both about to be called Abdullah, Abdullah. Abuela and <laughs> Abuelo and Abuela. <laughs> What did I read? Abdullah I'm, <laughs> I'm having cheese chicken pastry wrap. Very nice. That shirt is legit. My tiger shirt? Yeah, I love animals. I'm a big tiger guy. Big tiger guy. <laughs> Excuse me. Hey, Munchkin. Hey, my milf. How you doing, girl? Is it fun driving a truck? My current job? Uh, if you would have asked me last Thursday, I would have said I love my job. I don't know how what I would say right now. But I do like driving for a living, yeah. I do have to say, my green beans are freaking delicious to the point where I made both of our kids try them. I can't read, uh, Abby. <laughs> I made both of our kids try the green beans that I made, and they both love them. They don't like green beans, but they like my garlicky green beans because if you put garlic on anything, it will freaking taste delicious. Hey, Mama Pert. Hey, Mama Pert. How you doing, girl? What's on the menu? Buffalo chicken parmesan uh, burritos for me. And then khaki has got teriyaki chicken. Teriyaki chicken. You got... Uh, where's MB? She usually tells me, Jamie, can you move the camera? And I said, yes, MB. Where are you from? We're from Long Island. Oh, Jamie, my gym goals. That video was hilarious. Yeah, I kind of knew something was up once... Once I saw how he was doing it, I just wasn't expecting someone else seesawing his leg up and down. Hey, What's up, Kevin? Kevin? How you doing? <laughs> Jamie, you doing, I my struggle. Friend? Jamie, I struggle with reading too. I have a reading disability. Yeah. Well, I think a lot of people do. Some people are embarrassed of it. I'm not. I'm kind of used to it. I will be the first person to tell you that I am dyslexic with numbers. So if anybody like puts a number out there, I'll read it completely backwards. Just looking at it, I will read it completely backwards. John, I haven't seen him since like 2010. I still remember what that little, you know, I didn't remember what he looks like to a T. You know, never forget somebody that really tried to screw you over. You know what I mean? And when it comes to anybody trying to get somebody else fired, like let's just say 
Jack is in here right now. Jack, I don't like you. Don't care how much I don't like you. I would never try to get you to lose your livelihood. Hello, Steve Russo. How you doing, my friend? Steve Russo. Top, Jackie, I, top of the evening to you. I'm really bad with really bad dyslexic. I'm only dyslexic with numbers, which is crazy. It's only numbers, not letters. You guys right. are amazing, an amazing, strong couple. Love it. Thank you, Kathy Mary. Appreciate it very Mwah. much. Thank you, girl. Hello, Mr. Savvy. How you doing tonight? Might as well bite the burrito that my brother bit. You might as well, because he said it was delicious. Yeah, I bet he did. Let's see. One to ten, where am I going with it? You got to watch my video, though, to really know what I'm about to get myself into. Would you like to tell these fine people joining us for dinner right now what I said before I even tasted this burrito? About this burrito? You said it what was... What did Daddy say? You said it was going to be good. Oh, I said more than that. I said, this is going to be... I said, I have a feeling this might be the best burrito I've ever tasted. Not even the best burrito I've ever created. And the flavor on in this burrito really smacks the shit out of your tongue. Because this is I'm very, sure it is. I'm sure it's very delicious. powerful. I'm about to dig into my chicken. Oh, baby, I got to go with the 10.1. What's up, Apple Pie? I dig your cooking videos. Great music and editing. Where are you? In the States. New, New York, York here. Yeah, we're also from New York. Yeah, we're in New York, too. Oh, my chicken is freaking phenomenal. Hmm. No wonder why he, he's like, he's like, you already let me take two bites of it. Let me just kill the burrito. I said, no, I'm starving. And normally Jamie doesn't finish his dinner. <laughs> so I think he's kind of banking on Jamie not eating all of his food. Oh my God, my chicken, my chicken is so freaking. You tasted it already? Good. Oh, you tasted it? Was that your first bite? Second bite. Second bite? I'm not a big teriyaki guy. Mm. Coming out of him like lava, Abby, LOL. That's what he'll text me, sitting on the toilet. Yeah, well, if you call us after stream, I won't answer because I'll be on the toilet. <laughs> Hi, Ruby, from Michigan. He seriously does message me while he's sitting on the toilet. You message me. I don't ever get on the bone, so let me see what Jimmy Jim is doing. Let me talk doing. to Jimmy Jim while I'm pooping. That one, well, <laughs> when I, well he, we have a thing. Now when he does text me or call me, I'll just send them a meme of like someone on a toilet and he'll just do LOL and then we'll chit chat <laughs> from there. I think everybody's got a, uh, has a poop buddy. You should make dip tacos with the burrito. Whatever. It's spelled. Mm. Yeah, no. Stacy, I would love to have burrito tacos. I've never had them. Me neither. Mine looked like it, though, tonight, when I was doing that thing with the, the tortilla. My sister makes them. She makes them, apparently, really well. But she never made them over in Florida. No. And I was kind of looking for that. But my sister, Debbie, she cooked a badass dinner. Badass pork dinner. Super good. Man, that is a flavorful burrito. I give that a 10. I gave it a 10.1. It's where he goes when in deep thought. And don't you ever call me your poop buddy. But you are. <laughs> <laughs> I don't talk to don't anybody else. Don't you ever call me your poop buddy. Well. Everybody has a poop buddy. If the shoe fits, Jimmy Jam. Hello, Evelyn. You might want Do y'all usually it. have leftovers? Sometimes. Yeah, I had like last night, Jamie had leftovers. Last night there was leftovers, and then our daughter gobbled it up today. Mm hmm She ate up that egg salad. Oh my god. Do you she want to try mine? Like, this was so good. Oh my god, I know it was so good. You don't have to if you don't want to. No, I'll try a bite. Go ahead. I just think it's really good. Yeah, my palate. <sighs> Thank you, Michael. <laughs> Ruby said poop, buddy. Yeah. Uh, the bathroom is the guy's man cave. Yeah, well, I think women 
can, you know, whether they want to admit it or not, spend a decent amount of time in there, too. No, we don't. Mm. Good, right? Oh, yeah. Yours is really good. I did french fries on the side also tonight, but I feel Hello, like Rabbit. it's been a minute since I did tater tots. Chicken does look amazing. Yeah, I Listen, I kind of got screwed out of the seasoning I usually use because my brother is a big chicken and rice guy, chicken and pasta guy. Uh, and, you know, he's been using it, which is no big deal. No big deal until he only left. Until I needed it and there was like nothing bit. left. <laughs> And that's when shit hits the fan. And I was going to text his ass. Mm, Kathy is right. Women get in and out. Yeah, that's right. We do get in and out. We don't sit there in the bathroom. We don't. We do our business. And we get out. <laughs> when I was little, I brought oatmeal we are in there. in and out. I had oatmeal on the bowl when I was like 10, 11 years old. And get out. Guys can be in there for hours. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Agreed. I think we can all agree on that. That women are just like, we do our business, get out. Men just, you know, linger. They just linger in there. Well, back in the day, you used to have like a little magazine rack, right? You would read, would do whatever. Well, I used I to have read. like those magazines that I used to keep in the bathroom before like phones were a thing because we're that old to yeah. the point where... Phones weren't a thing. We would just like read magazines. <laughs> and I used to have magazines in the bathroom before we had like iPhones because iPhones weren't a thing back then. So Yeah, we didn't get, me and Haggy didn't get our first iPhone until 2009. Right? 2009? You got the first iPhone. I, I kept my Nextel. Yeah. I kept my, my Nextel for a while. You don't have time to sit in there. You have a kid screaming, Mom! Kids, stay away from men. Jamie's traumatized by kids farting on them. <laughs> they know better than to come near Yeah, basically. Basically, Jimmy Jam. <laughs> it's usually like, what are you doing in there? Are you pooping or peeing? Yeah. <laughs> That's literally what I get. Are you pooping or peeing? Your, your husband's None of your got business. all the toilet <laughs> games as a gag gift. Yeah. I think my husband, yeah. <laughs> I could. T I remember the first wrestling magazine was, uh, I don't remember, I must have read this magazine, or looked at the pictures, I should say, for years, because I used to go back and it was like a Pro Wrestling Illustrated uh, magazine, and every once in a while I would go through it, I'm like, oh, he's on TV, oh, hey, that's so-and-so, that's so-and-so, because, you know, they get brought up to TV, they become big stars but I know them from being indie guys who is developing a name for themselves and it's like no matter how many times I would go back I would see someone that has finally made it <sighs> my son is on for hour at least yeah hello Kimmy hi Kimmy girl how you doing your son's yeah so is our son but he also brings his tablet in there He's like playing games, doing whatever the hell he has to do in there. <laughs> I don't know. To be in the bathroom for a long ass time is for real. I agree. <laughs> I agree, my mouth. Sometimes when I get back from my run, I'm editing a video. That's what keeps me on there longer. Jamie, I started watching Step by Step again. Long story short, Notice that the only magazine in there always reading is WWE wrestling ones lol really brings out the clarity I haven't seen that show in a long time. That used to be one of my favorites You sound better. How are you feeling girl? Oh, I feel so much better Kimmy. Oh my god girl. I feel so much freaking better than I did So much better. Thank you for asking This is a winner my chicken is freaking a winner too. Oh my god. This chicken. I think this is like the best chicken I've ever made. Step by Step is on HBO. 
You like WWE? Me too. What's up, Chrissy? I mean Hulu. It's on Hulu. Oh, okay. Do we have Hulu? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah, Kimmy Kaki's finally back to uh, oh my God. 100%. Back, she got a walk-in today. To normal. Got my walk-in today. Got some exercise. <sighs> it's so nice to feel normal again. <laughs> it really is. It's so nice to feel normal. It's usually the running video if I have to, Munchkin. Not the food videos. <laughs> Editing on the toilet. <laughs> Who's your favorite WWE wrestling? W uh, Macho Man. Bret Hart. <clears throat> yeah, I saw your story. We were like picking the wrestlers. Yeah. And I like I picked it before you even like nodded your head. I was like, oh, I know him so well. I was like, oh yeah, this one, this one, this one, this one. I was shocked that you picked um, Macho Man over Shawn Michaels, though. If I, if you, because you did, I know, I know. If that was a younger version of me, it would have, it would have been the other been way. Definitely Shawn Michaels. It would have been the other way around. I think, um, you know, and I've said this before. My opinions on people uh, have changed as I've like, as you've gotten older. As I've gotten older, like I, I, I. <clears throat> Shawn Michaels was my end all be all my whole life. And then once I started to like uh I was always a HBK guy over Bret Hart, right? And then eventually I did the thing that wrestling fans hate. I crossed over. I became a Bret Hart guy over. But it took me a long time and that's just because like my uh my attractiveness yes, to personalities have changed a lot. So I ha I look at things that I like like younger me and then adult me. Things change. I always wondered why you look in three, three ways. Because we're we have, we're live on three different platforms right now. Yeah. Yeah. R.I.P. Dusty. Kaki Jamie called me the other day quite upset. He even broke down crying some. He said it finally hit him that you'll be subject to a life on oxygen. He slowly continues to take your breath away. <laughs> What's up, Clinton? How are you? No. Uh, yeah, no, we hit. So, anybody wondering why we're not just looking directly into like TikTok or directly into yeah. YouTube or directly into the hard cam? Uh, we have. Three cameras that we're constantly looking at. Abby, and then he's there, messing around, girl. <laughs> and then there's monitors that we read that helps us read the comments be better. Mm. Did he really, Jimmy? No, I don't. He's cry messing Jimmy. around. I, cry, I might have cried one time with Jimmy. He's messing around, though. Maybe I don't even think I cried. I was upset though. <laughs> I don't even think you cried. I don't remember him. I think Jimmy's just messing around. Uh, look, I don't want your husband. Watch your mouth. Do don't, that part. Do that part. <laughs> no, Clinton. Buffalo chicken parmesan burritos for me, and then Kaki made uh, teriyaki chicken. Teriyaki chicken. I don't watch sports, no. Not a sports guy. Hello, Jester. No, thank God. We're not sports people. Mm -mm. Hey Shirley, how you doing, girl? We uh I don't even watch TV for the most part. But I got sucked down a TikTok clip of a show and my brother was like listening to what I was watching. So you went down a TikTok rabbit hole. It was one video, but I got very into it, and I'm going to watch it. It's called Suits. Suits? It's on TV. Yeah, it was on. It was a TikTok clip, mm -hmm. and my brother's like, "You watching Suits?" And I said, "I don't know. I've never seen this before." And uh, I was very, very into, you know, the minute and a half, two minute clip of whatever it was. Hey, so Noreen. I think the the next show I do decide to give a shot is going to be that. Hello, Noreen. Jimmy Jam, you ever see Suits before? I've never watched Suits, but I know it's a good show, apparently. 
A lot of people like it. Hey, I've Corlin. never watched it though. Hello, Court. How you doing, my friend? Suits had Suits had our girl on it. Really? Actually, I'll Suits just give had it. Tim Tiffany Amber Thiessen. Yeah, I don't know why I said that. You could have her. I'm not. She's not my girl no more. I give you full. Uh, she actually came across my FYP like yesterday. Yeah, with her leftover stuff. Mm -mm. She was doing like this, like snack review, where she would take like a chip, like a Lay's classic chip, put a pickle on it, and put ranch on oh, it. Oh yeah, I saw that. Oh my god, I would totally try that. Totally try that. Uh, he my brother, Lever. Who? Tiffany Amber uh, Thiessen. Doing well, eating some late night tempura shrimp. That's right up my alley, Court. Hell we're, yes. We're frozen on TikTok. Oh yes, we are. It's not a very nice angle of me either. No, I'm, I'm gonna, like. Nah. Oh no, we're like really frozen. I hate that when the whole thing glitches. My mouth, you saw that too. You wanna try it? Me too. I wanna try that too. <sighs> we'll fix it. Oh wait, don't make him mad. We're, our video is frozen, but there's still comments. Yeah, well I'm getting out of it. Now we're, on, now we're not on it no more. Yeah, I think that would be really good, my mouth. Like the chip with the, with the pickle and the ranch. I think that would be freaking delicious. It seemed interesting. It's totally something I could definitely try. Let's try this again. She bops, he bops, to win bops. Pickle taffy. Yeah, I already said I don't think I would try pickle taffy. I don't know. Let's see what my mouth says. I don't think I would try pickle taffy. I think that would be weird. Let's see if I fixed it. I don't even care. Just to try it. Yeah, I don't think I would try it, though. Mm. I think that would be weird. Pickle taffy? Mm. Yeah, rah, rah, rah. Excuse me. Oh, man. Almost lost it there. <clears throat> I think Jimmy Jam left. We froze, Kimmy. Yeah, we froze on TikTok. I redid it. I don't I don't know if it's back yet. Jimmy's bandana is a cross between Rockers 1989 and DDP when he started wrestling close manager's character. Mm. His jacket, we need to pay homage to the tag teams of yesterday, Jimmy. Well different theme would be fun. Um so I remember buying this material, and I remember the day I made this headband. This is one of my favorites. Mm, hello, Melissa. Hello, Jess. I hello, Maureen. Welcome back. Yeah, hey, guys. I don't know what happened. We froze. Yeah, we froze. I don't know why. It's funny because when it comes to, like, some of my favorite headbands, and I've been, I haven't made a new headband in a while. I shouldn't say that. I made one a couple of weeks ago. But I remember Hello, Nancy. Hey, certain, girl. hey, Lexi. Certain fabrics, like certain materials, I'll see the colors or I'll see a certain pattern and I'll, something will, if something hits me like you should do it, you know, this way, I'll buy the material and usually do it that night. <laughs> this, I believe, was a bathing suit. I could be wrong. Well, All of your headbands are even, thank you very much. Oh, Beach Girl said she wants to buy the butterfly one. Which one? The butterfly one. You know which one. I got two butterfly ones, three butterfly ones. I think she meant, did you mean the green one? Because that's my favorite. That's my favorite one. That's the one everybody wants. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite one. Uh, I remember making that really quick and didn't think, I loved the green color. I loved that navy, you know. Yeah, it was like a dark green color. Yeah. And, That's like, oh, sorry. And I, didn't mean that. I just remember, like, I'll just put a couple of butterflies on it, 
and see what happens. And everybody loved that. Everybody night. loved that. Yeah. That was a really nice one. Happy? No. I used to eat the airheads like after baseball. I like taffy. I do like taffy. I preferably like banana taffy. If I'm going to be specific, I like banana taffy. But I, I don't think I would try like the pickle one. The pickle one, uh, that one seems weird to me. I don't Ethan? think I would try it. <laughs> hello, Kelly. Kelly and, hello, and Haley Haley. say hi. Hello. What is banana taffy? Banana taffy. It's banana flavored taffy. You've never had banana taffy? Oh my god, I love banana taffy. I hated bananas as a kid except mm. in my cereal. I love banana taffy. Like an airhead? It's taffy. Is the airhead taffy? Yeah, it's kind of like the same consistency as like yeah. an airhead. But it tastes like bananas. When I was a kid, my father would... Me too, Kaki. Hell yes, banana taffy for the win. Banana taffy for the win. I love banana taffy. That's the only taffy I actually like is banana flavored taffy. I don't like the consistency or the texture of taffy. No like more. Tootsie Rolls, eh. Sometimes I have to be in the mood for like a Tootsie Roll. Like taffy is the same consistency as like a Tootsie Roll. And like I have to be in like the mood for a Tootsie Roll, but I could always eat banana taffy. Banana taffy is delicious. It's that fake banana taste that I love. Yeah, me too, Court. I love that fake banana taste. <laughs> me too. Laffy Taffy sounds so familiar. I just, I'm having a mm -hmm. hard time placing Laffy it. Laffy Taffy? Yeah, no, sounds very familiar. That's what I'm talking about. Laffy Taffy has a banana flavor. That about my your favorite dad? Flavor. Was I going to tell a story about my dad? I might have. Um, I don't remember. I didn't, don't remember interrupting you either. Well, you, I'm used to you doing that all the time. But Michael, you don't have to be rude. What was I going to tell about my dad? What were we talking about? I don't ever remember you, like, about to tell a story about your dad. I think that person's trying to mind F you. Well, you're doing a good job if you are. Yeah, Michael. Guess what? Michael, you can take a hike. Make or buy this food. I made oh, this. We made this. Yeah. I made my food. Jamie made his food. We made our own food. And I made my green beans so good. You that need I... to chill out. What do you have? Something against the plate? Yeah, I guess so. Jeez. You should get a board. How don't you get a board? Mm. Or I could just cut it on you. You can get a board so you don't have to worry about that sound. Mm. And we can match. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I need a new Thank board. you, Nancy, because I think he's being rude. Because I don't think Jamie was going to tell a story about his dad. I don't remember. I don't think he was going to. What could I have possibly been talking about? You weren't. <laughs> well, that's just not nice. You were not going to tell a story about your dad. Okay, so we got to know who's the better cook, me. Uh, me. Who Who's, do you think taught Jamie how to cook? YouTube. Me. With a side hustle of Kagi. A little bit of my mom in there. Mostly me. Um, still on house arrest? Yeah. Uh, excuse me. How did you come to start making videos? How did you get into this particular shtick with love? Um, I started to... Uh, I started YouTube doing like vlogs that were not very interesting because I did the same shit every single day. And I wanted to be a daily YouTuber because I was like obsessed with Casey Neistat. And his videos kind of made you feel like you're uh, escaping reality. And I started with that and then it didn't take too long to realize that my life was not very interesting. <laughs> At the same time, I was like 300 pounds and fat, and I knew I needed to lose weight. So I started, uh, I started a weight loss, you know, thing. And I, the whole purpose of this, is not what you guys 
see now and it's not what you guys see on like my TikTok or Instagram videos. It was just me documenting my food videos and then as I got as I got better with like editing and stuff, I decided to give it a whirl and just make a dinner every night, post it every night, eat live every night and the idea was to see a 300 pound guy drop down to whatever it was my goal was originally going to be. And then consistency killed the cat, right? Mm -hmm. Like I just one month, two month, three month, four month, <clears throat> five month, six years. Yes, <laughs> Here we Noreen. are. Yes, Noreen, that was our son that was running with Jamie. That, that was our son. Yeah. Why did you stop wrestling? I got hurt. Had a couple kids. Didn't want to. I didn't want to stop, but once you start getting, once you start to be afraid of getting hurt, you're gonna get hurt, and I kind of. That's what happened with me. Jimmy realized like he's it was, he was afraid of getting hurt, and we have children. Well, so. I was afraid of that, and then it wasn't too long at the time there was a wrestler, a luchador that died in the ring. Um, by taking a kick from Rey Mysterio. And that scared the shit out of me because if you watch it and how it happened, it kind of changed my whole perspective on, and especially me being a careless bumper, uh, I just- You were a careless bumper. I was very careless and I just didn't want that to happen to me. Oh, you loved it, Noreen, yeah. Like he's really like taking a liking to- Hey, Harry. Deborah. So he's been running with Jamie for like the past two nights. So it's kind of cute. And I'm kind of happy for I'm, him. Yeah, I'm loving his attitude. I'm very proud of him. So proud of him. I'm loving his attitude because he's listening to what I say and soaking it in like a sponge with the whole not quitting and staying consistent with it and everything I'm telling him. Everything I'm trying to explain he's to him, to. he's listening to me. Like tonight, he was gung ho, ready to go. And then, as soon as we got out there, he's like, Is it normal for my legs to kind of hurt? And I said, Yeah. And he goes, Well, maybe we'll just take it slow. And I said, Go as slow as you want. And uh, I said, You know, the thing about running is you're not going to have a good night every night, right? And one thing every runner hates is you can't predict the kind of day you're going to have tomorrow. You could want to have a good run, but it's just you never know until you get out there. I, um, thank you, Noreen. She said, Jamie, keep running with your son. It fills my heart. I'm trying. I'm a teacher. It's important with self-esteem. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. I thank agree. You. I agree 100%, Noreen. 100%. Because, honestly, he just feels so proud of himself. Yeah. And I'm proud of him for doing do what he's we doing. Don't, we don't do ages. We don't give no, specifics, No, we don't talk about guys. ages. We don't talk about names, ages, nothing. Sorry. We just don't do that. But I am so proud of him. I really am. Yeah. He really is, like, taking himself out of his comfort zone. Tomorrow's going to be interesting. And he's doing something he's never really done before. I mean, he, he did it, like, once. Once, but you know, now he's on day two. Thank you, brother. Appreciate that. <clears throat> Clinton said, What's great about your videos, Jamie, is the music is awesome. The kitchen has a cool vibe, and you do crazy things with food that looks amazing that everyone can relate to. Badass. Badass. Thank you. Hell yes, Clinton. Badass. Thank you. That's all, Jamie. Though I can't take any credit. Yeah, for no, that. Kathleen. That's, that's okay. We just that's all, Jamie. <laughs> we uh we don't go into specifics. That's that's all. Oh, thank you, Noreen. I appreciate that. You're taking talking about your English. I assume didn't mean to pry. No, it's fine, Kathleen. We just don't talk about ages or names or anything like that. Who's beating Roman? Cody. I love that he's finding. If it's anybody other than Cody. I'm gonna be pissed along so mm -hmm. along with everybody else. Who the uh, hell else are they gonna mm -hmm. give it to? Yeah, speech girl. Agreed. I love that he's finding something to really connect with you. Yeah. He's really like 
thrown himself into it like the past two days. So I hope it, I'm hoping it keeps up. I really do. I hope it keeps up. And I, as much as I love LA Knight, it's not going to be LA Knight. He don't need it. The person that beats Roman is being shot to the moon. Mm -hmm. The talks and lessons is what he's going to remember. Jamie and his little mini me. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, Jamie and his mini me. Well, I told him, I said, because he's running in Adidas shoes right now. And he's like, these feel really good. And I said, if you stay consistent with the running, we'll go to the store and we'll get you a really good pair. And it'll feel like you're running on clouds. See, but he's weird with his feet. He's weird with his feet and his shoes. That's why he tries it on. We could use a turkey. <laughs> These burritos are good. Oh, you finished your dinner? I'm done. Mm. I'm done with my dinner. My dinner was damn delicious. I had a stuffed slice of pizza today with a grandma slice. Oh my god. I'm sure it was delicious. I love grandma slices. Those are my favorite. Good night, John. Catch Kevin. Grandma slices are my favorite. <clears throat> because they're like a Sicilian, but they're thinner and they're crunchier. Yeah. There's a place in, um, um, Bayshore. Alitalia has very good, um, has a good grandma slice. I think that's what your aunt brought here. And there's a place in Baldwin that has very good chicken ala vodka. Probably because you could take... I can actually chew now, beach girl, Kimmy. I can actually chew now. Like, my ear is, like, only hurting, like, a little bit. And I can actually, like, chew down and actually chew my food. <laughs> Thank God. That damn nasal decongestant that I've been taking for, like, a week now is finally working. Guess it takes time. Guess it takes time, but it's finally working. <laughs> For the most part, I can actually Linda, yeah. chew now. <laughs> Jamie, we need shepherd's pie soon from you. Maybe even school lunch, Salisbury steak, I think. It just sounds good about it now. Extra gravy, please. Ooh. Well, Jimmy Jim, you are in luck, my friend. I've been craving mashed potatoes mm. for a couple of weeks now, and it's going to happen this week. I just don't know what kind. I've been craving mashed potatoes, too. Colosso, Colossio, Import Jeff. Never heard of it. Come but, to Long Island, Colosco, and Colossio, Import Jeff. You know what, Nori? Me and Kaki were debating on. We going... were actually debating on going to Port Jeff or Long Beach. Like we haven't decided really where we're gonna go yet. It's like we go to Port Jeff. <laughs> eh, we go to Long Beach. We get to meet Emmy. So it's yeah. Long Beach and Emmy. Or at Port Jeff. Or Port Jeff. <laughs> We're weighing it out. I think we're going to lean more towards Long let's Beach say, and Emmy. <laughs> let's say Emmy is the paper towel. We're going to lean more towards Emmy. Yeah. <laughs> Why would you do that? Lucky's not down here, though. <laughs> no, I know. Although everybody playing. thought Lucky was, like, grabbing, like, a sandwich off the counter behind us last night. But it was just a paper towel. <laughs> but he was struggling for it. If, like, you actually, like... <laughs> Somebody tagged, I think it was Freddie something that like tagged like timestamp on the YouTube video. You actually see Lucky like struggling I towards. Know. I didn't look at towards, it. But... Oh, I did. I was laughing my ass off because you just see like here, right here, between Jamie and I's heads. Yeah. Lucky's struggling towards. <laughs> when do you think Cody will beat Roman? WrestleMania 40? Hey, with Shelley. With a question mark. I don't think it's going to be at WrestleMania 40. WrestleMania 40s in Philadelphia. Well, I mean, if you could do the comparisons to the whole Rocky thing, maybe. Maybe, possibly. I, you know, I was thinking it was going to be at a time where you're not expecting it. <laughs> We're still in sync. I guess we are, Jimmy Jam. We must still be in sync. <clears throat> I mean, what is next? The, 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 the next big one is Royal Rumble. Good night, guys. Stay amazing. Oh, good night. I, I'm always mortified 
I'm always mortified when you guys review the live. Sometimes I need to listen. I never really. First of all, Court, I never review. We don't review it. I don't review the comments on TikTok ever, unless there's somebody in there being an asshole. But no. like, I always watch like. I don't watch the YouTube, but like I if go to someone the, put, will put a time. Like, I go to YouTube, like our YouTube channel, and like whoever comments, sometimes somebody will like put a timestamp on there. Yeah, we'll look to see what that's about. And then be like, oh, your dog was eating a sandwich. This is what happened last night. Your dog was eating a sandwich, and then oh, you're right, a, Jimmy. There was a timestamp, so I clicked on it, and you click on like the timestamp, and it's hilarious because you just see Lucky in the background, like clawing at like whatever he's trying to claw at like behind Jamie's head <laughs> it was really funny I was like oh wow he's going hard and like oh yeah your dog's trying to eat a sandwich it wasn't a sandwich it was a paper towel but to the dog it probably was a sandwich <laughs> probably was a sandwich to the dog okay never mind I'm always staying PG and wonderful yeah I'm sure you are court <laughs> I'm sure you're not, Hello, but it's Ladybug. okay. <laughs> I didn't mean the lobster emoji. Oh, it's okay. Here's what I'll, here's what I'll say. Um, I think Randy Orton and Cody Rhodes are eventually going to hey, do Ladybug. it. Right? If, if Randy Orton comes back. But I think LA Knight's getting the other belt that Seth has right now. And I think uh, Cody's first feud... It's probably gonna be it's probably gonna be Randy Orton. But that means Randy comes back and turns heel. Cause they'd be crazy to turn Cody. That's just not gonna happen. That was a very good dinner. Wow. Yeah, my dinner was delicious too. Hey, can I have the nephew? I forgot now Lucky's down here. Alright, guys, we will see you tomorrow. Uh, happy birthday, I didn't forget, to Miss Sarah Hoffer. You better sing her happy birthday happy right now. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <clears throat> happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy Sarah. Happy birthday, Sarah. Mwah. Happy birthday, girl. Uh, you know I love you. WrestleMania 42, title versus title, Roman versus Cody. I don't know. They need to get rid of all the belts and just bring back the, the wing eagle. Okay, you said enough. <laughs> oh, Lucky wants his happy birthday. I know, but I don't want him <laughs> licking the, the hot sauce. Yeah, well, no, we don't want him licking do, the hot do, sauce. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do,